preaching is the hardest thing I've ever tried to do. I didn't volunteer for it. I didn't ask for it. That's the hardest thing. When I say it's the hardest thing I've ever tried to do, it's because if I lean, when I am leaning on me as I am most of the time, it's impossible to preach. That's my toy. But when God blesses me and the Spirit begins to move and I can I just feel that all over, and then it becomes very real. And then it becomes the easiest thing I've ever done. But I know that this world is so skeptical about those things. Because the world doesn't understand the things of God. But you know what? They was fighting that argument even in Peter's days and Paul. Peter who had walked with Christ and that whole generation there saw the miracles and been part of the miracles. <coughs> but even they had to defend that it wasn't a fairy tale. Peter told the people, he says, we haven't followed cunningly devised fables when we tell you these things. But we are eyewitnesses to these things. And the world is good and evil. You got to understand that when the people would see the miracles by Jesus, they just wanted to put him to death. Not believe him. Do you pray for just a minute of time? And we'll see if we can get ourselves out of the way and let the Lord move in. Something Shad hit on a time or two there and when he talked about seeking after God. I'm telling you right now, if you don't seek the Lord, you won't find Him. If you don't make the decision to seek God, you'll never be a child of God. Being a Christian isn't just being a good guy. Isn't just being peaceful in this world. But being a Christian means that you have sought out the Lord with your whole heart. This morning, I, I could so easily just keep my seat and say, Lord, let somebody else come. I guess it would be a whole lot easier if we just wrote out a sermon yeah. and just rehearsed our sermon for everybody or, or even gave everybody a copy and just let them read along with it. But it just don't work that way. And I would beg to this world You know, the Bible speaks about the ways of God as being a very narrow way to go. Not just anything is acceptable. Jesus told him like this, Enter ye in at the gate that is straight, at the straight gate. For wide is the gate, and broad is the way that leadeth to destruction. And many there be that go there and at. We know that, and I posted this last night about the road to hell is paved with good intentions. And I believe that with my whole heart. Uh, 
Now listen here to me today. If God will lift me up, I'd, I'd love to preach today. Uh, but if God don't preach me, then I'll just have to take my seat because, uh, listen, you can get your own Bible and read it. You don't need me to just stand here and read it to you. Uh, but listen, but why did we come out here this morning, Brandon? Uh, listen, uh, people, do you understand uh, that there is a witness, listen, and God's people coming together? Uh, what do you think Jesus was talking about? Uh, when he said, uh, why let your light shine uh, before men that they may uh, glorify your Father which is in heaven. Uh, there's a reason we come together uh, today and pray for me. Uh, there's a reason uh, that uh, we come out here to worship God. Uh, why it's not, it's not so that uh, we can fool people today. Uh, uh, you know how you feel about your family. Uh, you know how you feel about your loved ones. Uh, would you try to fool them uh, and teach them something that's wrong? Uh, uh, none of us would today. Uh, but oh, uh, but uh, we have a love down in our heart today. Uh, why we have a concern today. Uh, uh, why you know what? Uh, I love the Lord. Uh, oh, the son, uh, I love him. Uh, he's so good to me today. Uh, uh, but oh, I'm telling you uh, that uh, you don't just uh, accidentally become a Christian. Uh, uh, why you don't just uh, uh, take up a lifestyle uh, and become a Christian. Uh, uh, but oh, uh, you seek out the ways of God. Uh, uh, Jesus said, uh, uh, listen. He said, uh, uh, Ask and it shall be given you. Uh, uh, seek and you shall find. Uh, uh, knock and it shall be opened to you. Uh, uh, but oh, uh, can you honestly say today uh, uh, that somewhere along the way uh, uh, you sought the Lord uh, with your whole heart? And, uh, if you haven't sought Him, uh, son, uh, then you need to get on your knees today. Uh, uh, oh, uh, you know what? I tell you this right now. Uh, I was raised. Uh, just outside of Detroit, uh, up in Michigan there. Uh, uh, why am I? I was raised by an old hillbilly mom and dad uh, uh, who went up there for work in the 50s. Uh, uh, but oh, uh, dad, um, he said his family he used to tell him uh, uh, you'll never be able to raise a family right up there. Uh, you take them up there and all that sin. Uh, you'll never be able to get them to go to church if you do. Uh, uh, but oh my Lord, uh, he's more powerful uh, than anything that city's got. Uh, my Lord, uh, son, he don't just work in the hills of Kentucky. Uh, he don't just work in uh, uh, this country here, uh, but he's everywhere. Uh, oh, uh, but you know what? I was raised by a good uh, a good mom and dad uh, raised in a good Christian home. And listen, uh, here's the point I want to make. Uh, uh, why? Uh, you know what? I've never drank before. Uh, 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 listen, uh, uh, don't go around using God's name in vain. I never stole anything. I, I never done a lot of those things. But guess what? Uh, uh, oh, uh, when I was uh, 17 years old, I come to realize that uh, uh, being a good boy uh, wasn't going to take me to heaven. Uh, uh, the son, you know what? Uh, I remember uh, uh, when I was a child, uh, uh, when I'd go to bed at night, I'd say my little prayer at night, and I'd go to sleep uh, thinking everything's all right. Uh, these little children here, uh, uh, they're good as God wants them to be. Uh, uh, the son, uh, we don't need uh, to be taking these children out to the water hole and baptizing them. Uh, that wouldn't do a thing for them. Uh, uh, but oh God, uh, but I 
I remember. Now listen, uh, when I started to grow up, uh, uh, I, and I remember uh, uh, laying down at night uh, and saying my little prayer before I go to sleep. Uh, but you know what? I was no longer satisfied. Uh, I, I was no longer able to go to sleep at night uh, uh, with that clear conscience. Uh, uh, oh, come, uh, people today. Uh, how I, I'm telling you uh, that uh, being uh, uh, just a good person ain't going to get you to heaven. Uh, uh, I, uh, I told you uh, I never went out here and done a lot of these things out here. Uh, but you know what? God let me know uh, that uh, if I didn't, uh, uh, why, if I didn't repent on account of my sins, uh, I was going to go to a devil's hell. Uh, uh, oh. I remember uh, thinking, uh, uh, well, I will. Uh, I'll just uh, uh, quit going out at night. Uh, I'll quit uh, taking part with this world. Uh, and then I'll be all right today. Uh, uh, but oh, it don't work that way. Uh, Jesus said, oh, I, he said, uh, ask and it shall be given. Uh, uh, seek and ye shall find. Uh, knock and it shall be opened. Uh, oh, God, I remember when I started praying like that. Oh, Lord, Lord, God, I'm a sinner. Lord, forgive me. Help me, Lord. I didn't even know how to pray. I just knew how to beg to him. But that's all right. If you've got... Uh, uh, God's just looking for a sincere heart today uh, uh, Just like uh, that man uh, That was hanging on the cross with Jesus uh, Oh, uh, the man was guilty uh, Of all kinds of meanness uh, And was getting his just reward Hanging there uh, uh, But what did he say? Uh, uh, Jesus, he said, Lord, Lord uh, When you come in your kingdom uh, Remember me uh, remember this sinner man here. Uh, I got nothing. Uh, that man, he was already hanging on a cross. Uh, what do you think he had to offer? Uh, uh, he couldn't go to church, could he? Uh, he couldn't pay any tithes. He couldn't go down uh, to the water and get baptized. Uh, he was already uh, breathing his last breath there. Uh, oh, um, but uh, he had the one thing that he needed. Do uh, you understand everything you need to get to heaven? Uh, God's equipped you with. He equipped you with it uh, the day you was born. Uh, listen, and nobody uh, can take it from you. Uh, nobody uh, can get between you and God. Aren't you glad of that? Uh, yeah. uh, oh, God, uh, my Lord, he, he's been so good to me, and I don't deserve it. Oh, I, I'm telling you right now, I've never done anything to earn a blessing from God. I've never done anything to put God in debt to me. I'm an oh, all I know to do is live my life so that uh, the sun, uh, when I send my little groans through, uh, that maybe uh, God will smile on me. Uh, oh, uh, look at all uh, these little children uh, running around here. I know I'm the same. We work hard to give them things. Uh, we want a home for them. I understand that. Uh, but oh, I'm the greatest thing uh, we can give our babies is teach them about God. Uh, teach them uh, that He's real. Uh, because you know what? Uh, we won't always be here for them. Uh, we won't always uh, be able to put our arms around them. Uh, oh, how I like. Uh, uh, life's a 
cruel creature of some age. And don't slow down for anybody. Unless you think about that old pet ball. You know what? He might have split at this time. But guess, guess who's on his trail? Oh, God. Uh, but you know what's good about them? Uh, why, uh, guess what? Uh, when death comes knocking on the door, uh, why, uh, my Lord's there. Uh, my Lord, uh, listen, uh, death came, he overcame death. Uh, listen, a long time ago, uh, why, oh, death, where's I sting? Uh, grave, where's your victory? Uh, uh, oh, world gets along and you know what I haven't yet preached on anything I thought I was gonna preach on Allison I thought I was gonna be preaching about Joshua today oh God but I'd rather I'd rather feel my Lord in my heart Allison there's nothing more real to me when I first get up here and I begin struggling along Allison I trying to get my Myself out of the way. Uh, uh, why, it's a miserable thing. Uh, but you know what? Uh, when I feel my Lord begin to move in, uh, the hairs of my arms stand right up. Uh, but oh, and, and I'm ready uh, listen, to preach in front of uh, this whole world here. Uh, ain't no wonder. Uh, why? Uh, when my Lord sent His Spirit for the first time, uh, everybody uh, thought those disciples was drunk, uh, thought they'd gone crazy, yeah. and they'd never seen anything like that before, uh, and they'd, uh, they'd heard uh, Scripture read yeah. all their lives yeah. every Sabbath. Yeah. Uh, but oh, uh, when they heard the gospel preach uh, for the first time, and they thought uh, the world was turned upside down. Down. I have never seen anything like it. And now I just want to beg you today, uh, listen to your own heart. Oh, I, I know that God's uh, talking to you. I don't even got to ask you if he is. I know how he works. Uh, my Lord's pulling you. And uh, uh, listen, don't you know that uh, the devil, he'll never give you a good thought. Uh, the devil, he'll never let it into your mind. Uh, maybe we ought to go out to church tomorrow. Uh, uh, maybe we shouldn't do this. Uh, uh, listen, uh, maybe we shouldn't do that. Uh, maybe we should serve. God, uh, listen, uh, the devil will never tell you that, uh, but you know what he tells you, he'll say, well, uh, I know you want to go out to church, uh, but this came up, uh, that came up, I know you want to pray, uh, but you're so tired right now, uh, you'll pray tomorrow, uh, don't let it bother you, uh, that's the way the devil works, uh, oh, God. Uh, uh, my Lord, Allison, uh, uh, here's what I have. Uh, what do you have to get you through troubles? Uh, I'm telling you, if you're not worried today, uh, just hang on, you'll be worried by tomorrow about something. Uh, Allison, and what have you got to hold on to? Uh, Allison, well, my Lord tells me, he said, I've called thee by name. Uh, oh, Mine. Now listen, you know what? Uh, nobody can take that away from me. Uh, no matter what happens, I'll go down our little prayer list there. Uh, how many names come and go on there? Uh, uh, cancer's taking us out left and right of this world. Uh, the car wrecks are, are taking us out here. Uh, that uh, Kayla, uh, that lady you put on there, I lost that little baby. Uh, uh, there, it's not a respecter of age, people. Uh, 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 oh, uh, but my Lord tells me, uh, why? Oh, when, oh, when thou passest through the waters, I'll be with thee. And through the rivers, uh, they'll not overflow you. Uh, oh, 
uh, when thou walkest through the fire, uh, uh, thou shalt not be burned, uh, and neither shall the flame uh, be on thee. Uh, and you've heard the story about those Hebrews, and uh, they put uh, three of them in the fire there. Uh, why? And uh, what that old king say? He looked down in the fire there. He said, uh, "Did we put three in there? Uh, why do I see four people? Uh, why do I see them walking around in the fire? Uh, what can? Uh, what's going on here? Uh, oh, uh, my Lord! Uh, why he doesn't uh, listen? He doesn't never let me go." the fire, uh, but guess what, he's right there with me, uh, he's holding me, uh, and uh, people, I'm telling you today, it's the most real thing in my life, this church don't pay anybody anything, I told you, I told you, I didn't volunteer to preach. I didn't ask to preach. I didn't go to school to preach. I fought it, ran from it hard as I could. I was convinced I had just talked myself into preaching. But I'm just trying to serve God the best way I know how. Being born again is a real thing. It's not about just coming up here and bowing down and now you got it. It's just not the way it works. It is between you and God. It can be in your car, at work, anywhere you are. When you call on the Lord, when you give Him your whole heart, and not just with your mouth, He'll be found. I'm going to get out of the way and let Brandy come.